Well, misallocation is a sort of a general concept that doesn't only uh, involve labor, but all other inputs, presumably. Um, and it's been now uh, widely developed in the, in the literature, and it's an established sort of a methodology. The basic idea is, uh, it comes back to our uh, standard notion that marginal products of inputs, say capital and labor, should be equated across firms. And that it responds to an efficient allocation of these inputs across uh, firms. Uh, adjusted perhaps for their you know, value, uh, so prices times the marginal product of, uh, of, of capital and labor. Now when they're not equated across firms, that's called misallocation. And the, that will translate in the aggregate into a fall in the productivity of the economy as resources are not used at their best potential, highest potential. And labor market distortions in, uh, are one particular form of misallocation where labor is not allocated efficiently across uh, firms. And it might be partly because firms are not operating at the right scale relative to what they should be operating, either because they're operating at too large a scale or too small a scale, in which case it, it, it might be that there are, a, the, the reason why they're not, at, for instance, they're too small relative to what they should be, might be their borrowing constraints that do not allow them to uh, have the right amount of capital, and as a consequence, they ha don't have the right amount of labor either. <coughs> so they're indirect, or there could be the result of, of direct policies that are affecting or introducing wedges in the choices of labor across different types of firms.